Now, I know I have brought my daughters to work before uh, with a little, like, take your kid to work. Uh, I remember when they were really little, um, you know, they, they would, I'd bring them in and they'd just sleep in my office until basically you and I got off the air. Uh-huh. <laughs> and then they'd just hang just out for a minute. Uh-huh. Right, right. So really their experience with coming to work was just, when could they go to the snack machine to get Pop-Tarts? Right. Exactly. I mean, oh, that, we had a nice supply of snacks back in the day. Uh, we have a nice supply of snacks now, actually. Yeah. So okay. um, it's one thing to let your kids shadow you at work or maybe even learn a little bit of your trade, right? But here's where we draw the line. It's a setting the bar story, which is what, Kelly? It's an example of what not to do. Yeah. <laughs> huh. If you can manage to make it through the day without letting your 13-year-old, quote, assist you in brain surgery, you're doing okay. <gasps> What? Yeah, so this Austrian surgeon allowed his teenage daughter to drill a hole into a patient's skull. Are you kidding me? We're drilling into a skull at 13? So it was after an accident, and so it was kind of like one of those calls that, hey, you got to come in, right? And maybe it was on a weekend. Maybe it was like outside of business hours or whatever. Then we leave Junior in the waiting room. We don't let him scrub in and drill. What the heck, Doogie Hauser? And so the uh, person who had this uh, forestry accident was taken to the hospital. And the surgeon in charge of his emergency operation um, brought his 13-year-old. Which, by the way, if I'm a 13-year-old, like, I don't know it, that I'm not supposed to do that. If my dad is going, hey, do you want to hold the drill? I'm like, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Maybe it was one of those, like, on-the-job learning things. Yes, exactly. Right. And so l- allowed the 13-year-old to, quote, help. That is insanity. Yeah. And so now the surgeon is in trouble. Oh, you think? And they're saying, look... When you have this sort of job, you need to do that job yourself and no one else. I mean, I, I'm just wondering how quickly that patient is going to own the hospital. Listen, Kelly. Because are you not li- Kelly? calling top dog law? Kelly. What? Do they feel better? Did the kid do a good job? That's the question we should ask. Like, I know, listen, was right? It a quality hole that I was mean, drilled in your skull. I mean, maybe was, the then, kid did a good job. Let's not bygones. like we don't know how well the kid did. Maybe this kid is a prodigy. Maybe that this patient kid patient should be suing ASAP. So I okay. I don't know how much of this I can actually say. You I, did I help think, your your dad with dentistry. I did as a kid. I did. You? I did. Did you ever drill someone's tooth? So my dad, a dentist, me. The kid, he would get these emergency calls for like a root canal or something that was crazy, Mm -hmm. like on a weekend, right? Mm -hmm. And he had a dentistry practice that was open during normal business hours. But obviously there were those emergency things. And so uh, there'd be a lot of times on the weekend he'd get the call and he'd be like, all right, come on, Ben. I'd be like, yeah. And so, so so I would be his chair side, meaning he would bring me in. And he would have the patient, he'd put the patient under, like give him some laughing gas or whatever, and then I would hand him instruments, I would hold the suction. Okay, you could do the suction. I All right. didn't drill. You didn't drill. So that's okay. the difference between this 13-year-old kid and little 13-year-old Ben. Now, are you feeling upset that you didn't get a chance to drill? I wish I would have drilled. Yeah. Like if you would have said, here, Ben, I tell you what. Why don't you? No, but I'll tell you what, Kelly. I saw some stuff. Oh, I bet you did. Yeah. Thousand percent. Yeah. I was like, listen. Enough stuff to make sure that you're not going to ever be a dentist. Ain't no HIPAA laws here. I can I can squeal. Wow. <laughs> I didn't I didn't take any sort of hope, uh, any sort of oath. Wow. Uh, so, anyways, uh, yeah. No, I mean, I just didn't. I just didn't uh, want to become a dentist. Which, yeah. Okay. You know, probably would have been a better career path, but who knows. Who knows? Uh, <laughs> could, could we picture Ben drilling in your mouth? I'll tell you what, I'd be hysterical. Oh, I bet you would be. I'd be like, hey, Kelly, why don't you sit down, open up wide? I bet that's what he said. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
<laughs> no, you'd be like you'd st- you'd be sitting in the in a chair and you'd be you'd tell the guy, okay, listen, did you see the story about the surgeon that let his kid drill a hole in someone's skull? Anyways, <laughs> here, put this gas here mask on. I'll see you in a couple hours. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so listen, I again, this kid could be a prodigy, but 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 we're putting in this setting in the bar category because yeah, not a he, proper procedure. He yes, right. Yes. Kind of bypass some whole steps like whole, I don't know, medical school. We're we're not an official intern, medical intern. Right. Right. Do they even let the interns drill the holes? I'm uh, not sure. I'll tell you one thing. I remember when I had my knee replacement surgery, one, mm-hmm. two things were happening. One, the fire alarm was going off in the entire hospital. Oh, and they that's were like, disconcerting. oh, don't worry about that. Here, suck on this gas. And two, oh, we're going to get to that. Yeah. Yeah. I wheel in and, you know, there are 30 like interns and other people in the operating room. I'm like, oh, wow. So who knows who actually did my knee surgery? I, I would be like, listen, is this on video somewhere? I'm going to need to see a replay to see what y'all are doing. I'm I know. Nighty night. All right. So there you go. That is your setting the bar story. Okay. Good that's night. a fun, that's a fun one. That's that a, a fun one. That's a fun 13 one. year old drilled a hole in a skull. Well done, kid. Well wow. done. Wow. <laughs> I bet you did a bang up job too. Probably great. All right. That's your setting the bar story.